Good Monday evening, everybody. We are here in our hometown of Granite Falls, North Carolina. Now, the last time we brought you a video from here was the Merchants Festival back in the fall. Tonight, we are here for a different event, and that is our Christmas tree lighting. That's always, I think it's always the Monday night right before Thanksgiving. It is this year. So we're going to uh, stay for that. There's going to be some singing by some of the local schools, maybe some of the churches. Uh, just a neat little uh, lineup of events over the next hour, hour and a half or so. Uh, the reason my wife is not here right now is because she, uh, as a town employee, is helping. So we're going to be showing her here in just a minute as soon as I find her. I'm just now getting here and getting parked. But uh, tonight we're going to show you our uh, Christmas tree lighting festival uh, here in Granite Falls, North Carolina. So hope you enjoy it walk into the town square now they do have the road barricaded here by the two police cars and you're going to notice some tents set up and that's uh, a lot of the groups in the community some of them churches uh, some of them businesses they just set up a tent and they'll be giving out things like hot chocolate maybe uh, cider russian tea or something and, and cookies all for free so we'll walk around and show you a little bit of those Right here in front of the municipal building. This is, um, can't see just yet. Okay, so this is Mount Carmel Baptist Church from Hudson. And they're giving out, looks like, chocolate chip cookies and uh, maybe some hot chocolates. Solid Rock Baptist Church here. I know that's a good uh, independent Baptist Bible believing church. All right, thank you very much. Appreciate that. Those three trees right there that you see, those are the main ones that uh, get lit up uh, at the official lighting. There will be some events prior to that, but I know every year for the last long time it's been um, clear lights. would love to see some colored lights at some point, but um, we still we try to attend this every year. <laughs> I'm here a little early. It doesn't actually start until 6. All right, now here you can get you a biscuit, ham, sausage, or liver mush. If you live outside North Carolina or upstate South Carolina, you may not know what liver mush is, but that is a North Carolina staple. I'll show you a little bit of our town. We live in a small town. Hello That's there. good. So this is Poobie's Grove Baptist Church. Just a lot of the churches and businesses setting up, trying to spread a little holiday cheer. Clover Baptist Church. That's a local church here in town. What are you? This is the Assisted Living Center. They got all kinds of good goodies right here. I see all kinds of creamers. They must be giving out hot chocolates or coffee. So we still got about 27 minutes. And it looks like we're going to be hearing from the South Caldwell High School Band tonight. 
I think I showed y'all this at the Merchants Festival. I'm gonna go ahead and hit it again. There's actually a time capsule buried here and I cannot make that out. Anyway, it's supposed to be uncovered. I want to say 2031, maybe 2034. Uh, it is on the Merchants Festival video. The one thing we're hoping holds off is the weather. Uh, we have been in a drought around here for a while. We need rain badly. We're supposed to get a good full day of it tomorrow. I've already felt a few raindrops as much as we need it, and it's very welcome. We are hoping it holds off for just a little longer so we can have our tree lighting event without any Everybody getting wet. So I'm gonna walk down here and see if I can find Shaughnessy amongst all these people. Well, she's probably not amongst the people. She's probably under her tent in front of the town office. So that should be easy. I actually believe I have spotted her. Good. Yes, I see her. Let me get this sign right quick. Okay. All right, what do you think you're doing here? I'm serving hot chocolate and cookies. Hot chocolate? What kind of cookies you got? All sorts of kinds. Chocolate chips, all sorts of good kinds. Okay. Nice. I think the other booths are better. I'm going to go patronize <laughs> some of them. Thank <laughs> Yeah, they come shadow us every once in a while. Yeah. 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 So this would be pretty neat to be able to come uptown and get some free stuff as the community comes together to bring in the Christmas season. Pretty green tree right here. Dog buns here. I believe this is the best booth in town right here. Yeah, normally. We're gonna do some later. So, how are you? Hey. Hope you all don't mind being on YouTube. I don't mind. All right. Put us all out. Hey, some free hot dogs. Y'all got the best booth. You got the hot dogs. <laughs> <laughs> we've got hot cocoa. We've got cookies. Down through here and get some of these trees. And I'm going to take a recording break and grab me a hot dog here in a minute. I'll just stand here. And I got a camera that zooms now a little bit, so. I think the cotton candy's over here. Yeah, that's, um, I don't know what church that is. Somebody's got funnel cake. Starting to really fill up now. This is actually my nephew, my sister, my youngest sister's son. What's up, what's up? We wouldn't expect to see him here tonight, so we're going to put him on, ca on camera and make you famous. It's beautiful out here. Yes, it is. You usually come to this? Uh, no, not really. I haven't been here. In is any... Monica here? Uh, no. Okay. I'm here by myself. All right. Yes. Well, good to see you tonight. Good to see you. Later. <laughs>
Still hadn't got your cotton candy yet, have you? Oh, the funnel cakes are at the same table someone said. Right here? That's what she's saying. Okay, good deal. So right now it is very, very packed here in town. Welcome everyone tonight to Granite Falls, North Carolina. We're glad to have you here in town. The South Coldwell High School Band is under the direction of Jason Childers, and they are presented here tonight by members of the Wind Ensemble Percussion Section. These players rehearse and perform alongside their other talented musicians, but rarely do you get to hear them by themselves. So tonight, right now, we are pleased to present for the next several minutes, the South Colwell Percussion Ensemble. Let's give them a big hand, ladies and gentlemen. annual tree lighting ceremony. The festival receives support from the North Carolina Arts Council, a division of the Department of Natural and Cultural Resources, and from the Caldwell Arts Council. Wish you a very Merry now, Christmas and here a blessed New Year. As they get ready. Okay. This should be good. All right. I think we're ready for the next one here just about. Yep. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, I'd like to present to you right now the Sims Country Cloggers. They're located in downtown Granite Falls. And Sims Their team director and instructors include Ashley Holloway, I believe that's Tori Hicks, and Sydney Yunts, and Brianna really Starr. I hope I said those right. This is our team, and we're excited to perform a few Christmas numbers for everyone to help kick off the holiday season. We hope you enjoy and have a wonderful holiday season from all the folks at Sims Country Cloggers. So let's get it going. Here they are.
should give them a, a first of all, give them a warm welcome to the stage, the Granite Falls Middle School Chorus. Come on now. Okay, now let me. <laughs> and they're led by Ms. Taylor Moore. The Granite Falls Middle School Chorus is currently preparing for their Christmas concert on December the 7th. They've been preparing for months and are very excited to share their voices with you tonight. So without further ado, here we go.
ready for the next one. You're ready. All right. Okay. The Dudley Shows Elementary School Concert Choir is honored to be performing tonight for the first time on the Festival in Square. This group is a newly formed vocal group composed of 51 fourth and fifth grade students from Dudley Shoals Elementary School. Students meet twice a week for 30 minutes to grow their love of music and prepare for performances like tonight.
Falls Elementary School Course is a group of 30 on, uh, excuse me, 30 audition, on audition, there we go, fourth and fifth grade students who meet together once a week after school for an hour rehearsal of the direction of Andrea Edmund. <laughs> Jerry. Folks, it is time for us to count down and light the trees. If you're excited, let's hear your Christmas spirit. I've got to tell you, folks, Mrs. Claus and I are so excited about Christmas this year, especially getting to visit right here in Granite Falls. So here we go. Let's see if we can make some Christmas magic happen right here. Are we ready to count? All right, we're going to count down from 10 to light this tree. Everybody help me out. 10, 9, 